Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. First things off, 500 subscribers. For an old dude like me, I'm quite happy with that. 500 people, don't mind my silly little videos. And welcome to all you new subscribers. Been a while, sorry about that, uh, been busy. But here I am, and uh, today's a special one because today is my first ever pair of Vans. Uh, you know what they are because you can see the title. Um, but my daughter loves Vans, she's got some yellow ones. Um, and Vans have never really appealed to me, it's obviously a kid's sneaker or a kid's trainer but these ones are different now these ones are different because I am a NASA slash space geek I have the watch this is the watch that Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin wore on the moon uh, I have the book and I've got much 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 more Apollo paraphernalia now we'll talk about Apollo versus shuttle because there's a slight difference on these uh, sneakers um, but let's get into them let's have a look at these little beauties these are the uh, Space Voyager in true white from the new Vans collection. Uh, let's have a look. So these came out in four different colorways. They came out in these white, which is the sort of low top white ones. They came out in orange, hideous, not going to touch them. Uh, they came out in a white high top, not really for me. Nice patches, nice decals on it, but not really for me. Uh, and a black high top, which is nicer. I could have got away with a black high top, I think. But I've got plenty of high tops, and to be honest, I don't really wear them. Um, and... You know, these are just nice. So let's have a look. So first thing I think that's a bit of a disappointment is it, unlike, say, the Mars Yards, which are probably, the, you know, again, quite close to these as a, as a kindred spirit, this is just a bog-standard Vans box with a sticker slapped on the side. So nothing really special about the box. So that's unfortunate, I think. They could have done a bit more with that with a Moon Special Edition. Uh, here we get them out, this, out there, and we've got one left and one right. Get rid of the box because there ain't now special about that. So here they go. Uh, we have the two sneakers here. So let's have a look at some of these special features. We'll just pick one of them because they're more or less the same for each one. Um, so this is the um, like a joint collab that was done with NASA and Vans. Uh, and there was a few bits and I found out online. Uh, some of them, some are not. Effectively, Vans just said they used colors and schemes which were empathetic with uh, the NASA colors and schemes. And that's, so that's what we've got here. So that's why you see reds, oranges, uh, and some other bits and bobs. So let's have a look from the side. So what we got here, we can see that it says on there, uh, NASA, NASA, apparently that's called the Worm logo, uh, NASA, National Aeronautics and Space Administration, and it's the JFK, the John F. Kennedy Space Center, which I believe is in Houston. Um, but I may be wrong on that one. Uh, so you Americans can tell me if I'm wrong on that. Um, as you can see, there's some interesting details first off. So we've got an all leather upper, and it's quite a nice leather, um, not a cheap leather. Uh, this is you, this is your basic van shoe, by the way. So it's your basic van shoes, but with a nice leather upper. Um, and if we look at the sole, we've got these ridges. Now these ridges are exactly reminiscent of the ridges that were more with the moon boots. So the moon boots on the uh, on the astronauts' um, uh, spacesuits. These were the ridges that were sort of on the boots. So when you see Neil Armstrong's foot go plonk on the moon. This is the sort of ridges that went around it. So we can see the ridge. We've got that on, that's just printed on. So there's nothing special about it, but it's, it's nicely printed. It may wear over time, who knows. Uh, on the back, we have the, uh, the US flag. Go USA. Uh, well done to the Democrats. Sorry about you Republicans. Um, but we have the USA flag on the back and it pulls off. Well, apparently I read somewhere that what the, the kids in the US like to do is to put the flag on upside down. Uh, I'm not gonna do that because I'm sure I'll offend somebody if I did that. Uh, and I really can't be chewed with uh, YouTube comments of offence. So there we go, that's the American flag. Pulls off, goes back on again. Standard red Vans logo at the back, nothing special about that. Uh, and the patch itself is quite a nice little patch. Uh, on the inner of the shoe, I'm going to come closer there, you can see written, let me just get it there, uh, for the benefit of all, uh, which is nice, nice little sort of NAS logo. For the benefit of all is in a um, sort of indented, slightly raised, no, slightly raised, slightly raised, on there. Um, other features, so two other features, well three or four other features actually. Uh, Vans tag here, nothing special. Uh, we've got a nice sort of um, silvery grey tongue uh, and on here it says mission. On, on this one it's a shuttle on the tabs. Um, so these are actually sort of harking to the space shuttles rather than the Apollo missions, hence my point earlier of Apollo versus shuttle. So these are more like a sort of, this is about a space shuttle shoe rather than a um, and an Apollo moon boot, um, hence shuttle mission. But it's quite nice, very, very nice there. That's the mission. And here we have the shuttle. And there's a little sort of metal tab on the top. 
Uh, nice grey, nothing special about it. Um, what we can see though, again, harking back to uh, shoes that are inside and outside and a bit like the Virgil Blower, and we talked about this in a few of my videos recently, we have this sort of foam exposed top edge. So instead of this top edge being sealed as it normally would be, um, they've exposed the foam in the top edge, which I think is a nice touch. And again, it's uh, you know it's sort of Miles Yardy, it's Virgil Blowy, it's um, you know none of them the first, and they're not going to be the last. But it's really quite on trend with, with sneakers in the last year or so. So we can see that. Uh, and then the final point: so there's nothing special about the laces, set of white band laces. And on the inside, we have uh, a nice insole, uh, and this is, I believe, the command module. Uh, no service module, this is the service module. So the service module was the one that whizzed around the moon while the, uh, the eagle went down, uh, which was the command module that went down. That's the service module, that's effectively what they came back on as well. So that's very nice, well the top part of it was anyway, after they jettisoned the, uh, the back piece. Um, so that's on the inside of there, and I think on the inside of here, um, it's, the, it's the top command module. It sits on the top, that's the, uh, the sort of re-entry module. So very, very nice uh, vans. So that's it, very, very quick video. Um, very nice, we'll do a little quick uh, on foot on the end. I will not slow-mo for the people that don't like the snow-mo, um, but these are, um, I'm a size 11 UK. Uh, uh, as people will know from my previous videos, I'm an 11 UK in Adidas, I'm an 10 and a half UK in Nike, uh, I'm an 11 in vans. Uh, these fit true to size for me, so whichever ones you are, um, you know, if you're an 11 Adidas, you will be 11 in bands. Uh, so that's it. So hope you enjoy that. Very quick overview. Gorgeous shoe. Um, one of my favourites this year, to be honest. I think it's just a nice, clean, simple shoe. NASA themed, which I'm always going to love. Uh, love it, love it, love it. So there you go. Bit of dead stock at the moment. Hard to buy. Uh, there is some tiny sizes. So if you've got size six feet, you could probably pick up a pair of these in orange. <laughs> enjoy those. Um, but you, they're not that bad on resale. I've seen these reselling for 150, 170 uh, on eBay. So not horrendous on resale. Now, let's have a look at them on the foot.